Hey, Andy here from buildahottub.com. In this video, I'm gonna look at whether you can use a variable speed pool pump on a hot tub. So let's go ahead and take a look. Okay, so can I use a variable speed pool pump on my hot tub? In short, the answer is no. And in this video, I'm gonna go through and explain exactly why they're really not suitable for a hot tub application. They are fantastic for pools, they can save you money, and I'll look at some of the benefits as well, but you can't use them on your hot tub, so let me explain why. Now, before we get going, always a great opportunity to say please do subscribe to the channel. I do two long form videos just like this every single week, whole bunch of shorts, loads of information about DIY hot tubs and pools on this channel, that's my focus, so please hit that notification icon to be notified when my videos go live. Okay, so what is a variable speed pool pump? So a variable speed pool pump, it's quite a modern thing. They are super efficient and they work by digitally controlling the speed. So your pump is actually able to run at a whole multitude of speeds between two lower limit and an upper limit on the pump. The whole idea is it increases efficiency, it allows for better water quality, it also reduces the amount of noise the pump makes because it's gonna be running at a lower speed, so that can be helpful, certainly for your neighbors. Of course, they are more energy efficient. They're gonna last longer because they run at lower speeds. And of course, you've got more control over the whole filtration process. So there's loads of advantages. Now these advantages really are only for pool owners. They're not for us hot tubbers. So the common misconception is that a variable speed pool pump is the same as a dual speed hot tub pump. And it's, it's not, they work in very different ways. As I've said, the variable speed pool pump is actually digitally controlled. Whereas the dual speed hot tub pump is either on or off at two different speeds. The low speed is used for filtration. The high speed is used to power the jets. And the way that these are controlled is basically a voltage is applied either to the low speed terminals or the high speed terminals. So it's really on or off in either of these two speeds. Whereas the variable speed, it can be anything between, as I said, that lower value and the upper value that has been set on the pump. So as we can see, the two are very different, even though they are both really operating at, at different speeds at different times, the way that they do that is very different. And this is important because with our hot tubs, we're looking for a spa pack to actually control things. So let's take a look now at why a variable speed pump isn't gonna work on a hot tub. So the spa pack is very much the brains of our hot tubs. It allows us to control the pumps. It allows us to control our air blowers. It also allows us to control the heat because they generally have an electric heater inside. There's a thermostat in there. The spa pack will control your filter cycles. It will control your purge cycles. So it really is, as I say, the brains of our hot tub. However, if we break it down to what really a spa pack is, it's a series of relays. So it's a, a relay that is being turned on or off when you want to run your blower. It's a relay that is being turned on or off when you want to actually heat the hot tub with the electric heater. Okay, and it's the same for the pump. So if we remember, I've said that the variable speed pump is controlled digitally. So the, the speed of the pump is actually set by a digital controller on the, the pump itself. Now our spa pack doesn't have one of these. As I said, it has relays. So if our spa pack is looking to turn a relay on, on the variable speed pump, it's, it's not gonna find anything to, to adjust the speed or anything like that. It's basically gonna apply a voltage to it to turn it on. So that variable speed pump it goes from having you know, a digitally controlled speed to basically being able to be turned on or off. So it's, it's not gonna work because the pump itself wants more than just a voltage to, to turn it on. Conversely, with a hot tub pump, our hot tub pumps are just looking for that voltage. So it's looking for a voltage on the low speed terminals if we're looking to heat, 
filter that hot tub. If we're looking to run the jets, it's just looking for a voltage on the high speed terminals on the pump. So as you can see, very different setups and our spa packs are just not geared up yet. I'm sure at some point in the future, they will be. They'll become a bit more advanced than they are now. But at present, having a variable speed pump isn't gonna work for you because it will just be turned on or off by the spa pack and the variable side will not work. So hopefully I've not confused you too much on this video. I hope that you have found it useful. You now understand why variable speed pumps can't be used on hot tubs. As always, I appreciate the view. Thanks for the watch and I will see you on the next video. If you've liked this video, please do like, share and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you on the next video.